Hello everyone, this is going to be a very short a review of iTop VPN. Is this the best VPN? Why it isn't the best? Why it is the best? I will show you why. So as you can see, here are a couple of things you need to take in consideration before using iTop VPN. iTop VPN has over almost 2000 servers in 100 countries, but it's enough to access multiple streaming services gaming and enable other online activities. So if you want to maybe use it for gaming or maybe for streaming services or maybe even for torrenting, you can definitely use this and it is recommended uh, for those type of activities. Now iTop VPN is a gaming based VPN, so it actually is recommended for gaming as well. Now it has good security, so iTop has military grade protection and additional features like a kill switch ad blocker so you will be protected against internet threats uh, immediately right because it has a very very good uh, a very good protection right now although it has a very good protection it also has terrible privacy the vpn retains a lot of information about you and your online activity so you may want to check out its privacy policy right simon tenlius connections which you can connect five devices right with its premium plan uh, it also has modest capability, so iTop is only available on Windows, Android, or iOS. It also has free plan, and but it's quite limited, right? So you will need to pay for a premium plan. As you can see, the price is almost $4 per month. It is a pretty budget-friendly. I would recommend this VPN for someone that wants to maybe use it for Netflix or maybe use it for, you know, Hulu or something like that, or maybe use it for gaming because this is a great VPN for, uh, you know, for gaming. Now, overall, the, uh, the score on this side is 5.4 out of 10, which is not bad. It could be better, uh, but yeah, as you can see, key features are 5.5, installation and apps are 5.3, pricing is 1.3, right? And then reliability and support 3.3, which is not that good. Now, as you can see, it supports torrenting as well. And uh, as you can see, support is the only online feedback page. So you can actually go and contact the support, right? So that's pretty much it. I would say the only downside here is that you cannot uh, contact support because they just have online feedback page. Uh, other than that, I think this VPN is uh, really good. I would give you, uh, I would give uh, the VPN much higher price, uh, much higher rating, not price. Sorry, but... Uh, yeah, that's pretty much what I would uh, what I would give it. So if you ever use this VPN, comment down below what your experience is with using it. I would love to see what your other people are saying about this VPN. And if you have any questions, uh, we can comment down below and uh, chat about this VPN. Thank you guys for watching. We'll see you in the next video.